This is Fox 5 News at 5. What I'm listening to on these headphones may be helping children on the autism spectrum. I'm Beth Parker. The story coming up. A business in Bethesda is drawing clients from all over the country, even around the world. They work with children who have sensory issues, including some children with autism. Fox 5's Beth Parker shows us they're seeing changes that keep families coming back. Three, four. Ned Corzine is a kid jumping on a trampoline, but he's wearing headphones and watch what happens next. Ned, every time you catch it, I want you to name an animal. Okay, I'm gonna start. Dog. Cat. Ned has autism. Michelle Herman is an occupational therapist at Dynamic Development Pediatric Services in Bethesda. While she's helping Ned practice different tasks, he's listening to Mozart. Music. Not the Mozart we're used to. Ned is hearing a filtered version with only the high pitches. Those particular tones stimulate his inner ear and help train his brain how to analyze information more effectively. It's called ILS, Integrated Listening System. Cindy Corzine is Ned's mom. When he first started doing this, we noticed a big increase in his communication skills and the patterning of his speech. They really noticed the improvement one day in the car when he and his younger brother started arguing. He's touching me. Stop it. Now make him stop it. When their father got angry, I put my hand on my husband's arm and said, stop. This is what how many years have we worked towards him having that relationship, that give and take with his brother, defending himself against his brother? You stop it. No, you stop it. And it was just such a beautiful aha moment for the both of us. We were like, they're fighting. Now, what I'm doing here seems simple, but it's actually a complex task for the brain. That's because the sides of the brain and the body are talking to each other to keep my eyes following the ball. That's something they work on here. Ned also works with audiologist Lisa Layden. I'm going to put my headphones on so I can hear what you're okay. saying. Ned has trouble filtering out background noise. It's a common problem. Whether it's traffic noise outside, whether it's the air conditioner in a classroom setting. He has to focus and listen closely for words and phrases that he must repeat while music or other noise comes through the headphones. The rat ran from the black cat. The process is highly tailored to each child. The sessions must be intense and frequent. This therapy is not a panacea, but it's helping Ned reach for his full potential. Arms up. In Bethesda, Beth Parker, Fox 5 News. That's okay. It looks like it'll just be a blessing for so many families who have children on the autism spectrum. Yeah, it just seems little by little we're getting there. Absolutely. Exciting.